This is Cindy Meniere with the Do to Book Creator. Today I'm going to show you how to use our Front Matter page tool to create covers. To get to the tool, click on Interior Tools, Front Matter Page Tool. First you're going to want to select your trim size. You can pick from any of the standard KDP trim sizes. I'm going to do a 5 by 8. I'm going to start off by creating a back cover, so I'm going to click on back cover. The back cover option will provide you with a template you can use to put all the information you need on your back cover. To modify the text, you can double click in any of the text boxes, type whatever you want, you can change the font, you can change the alignment, you can change the font size, and you can also change the font color. If you wanted, you could add an image from either the files that you've uploaded previously to your account, or you can drag and drop any image you want into the page. I'm going to highlight all of the text boxes and change the color to white, because I know I'm going to have a background color for my cover. Lastly, I'm going to save the page I created so that I can use it in the cover creator later. Next, I'm going to select the title page option to create the front cover of my book. I can highlight the text, change it to what I want, change the font, move things around, delete things I don't want, add in some graphics, and finally I'm going to change the, cover, the color of everything to white so that it will match the back cover, and then I can save it to use in the cover creator. To get to the Cover Creator Tool, click on Cover Tools, Cover Creator Tool. The first thing you need to do is set your trim size. Again, you can pick from any of the standard KDP trim sizes. I'm going to stay with 5x8. And then I'm going to pick a color for the background. I'm going to go with this nice blue color. Now I can add in the back cover I just created with our Front Matter Tool. and then add in the front cover I created. There you have it, super easy. The cover is already ready to go. I click on download PDF and now I'm all set to upload this to KDP. If you have any questions, please let us know in our Facebook group or you can contact us through our contact form.